right, we are back in the black deserts. As you can see, it is very, very dark. And... Hmm. Yeah. Okay, let's sleep off tonight and do the normal trick. And we have coal in our face, so let's uh, get rid of this. Torch goes there, bed goes there, and we'll sleep. And when we shift, you see my face. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, back in Black Desert. Still hunt for the Victory Monument more than anything else right now. Um, we know where Pink Wool is. Well, we reconfirmed that the Pink Wool is indeed in the same spot as the other trials. And... Now, it's time to foray into the darkness. It seems we have reached a wall on this end, so we can go explore that and put food on our bar, which is health. As you can see, I'm still in 1.7. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. And we're in the action already. Where did these mobs come from? We have enough string for a bow, so I'm not worried about the drops. And they only drop string, they do not drop spider eyes. Whoa. Here's some gravel. Okay, so I'm still on the hunt for Victory Monument, and it seems as though this corner or this wall is not where it's at. And it's Obsidian Wall. It's nice. It's. Oh, oh, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Dang it. Bread it is. Well, that took a bit of armor down. Um, yeah, so I think I'm going to explore it this way again. And that's three zombies. There is no sprints and... That's a hole that I fell into. Oh no, the zombies are definitely coming. And how are we going to get to that wall? Um, probably through that point and... Hmm. Nope. Get away, get away, get away. I still need some wood. Need a, I need a fork bench and a little bit of a lag spike that dips, dips me underwater. We have a lava bucket to power. Ooh, dirt. This could be coming useful. They're coming handy. Coming useful. What type of language is that? There's a lot of torches over here. They do not avoid lava. <laughs> and let's get this feather. Because that's what zombies drop. And did I put down these torches? I don't remember this. Oh. And I tried to block with my sword. But as you might be aware, it does nothing. You did give me cobble though. Um, I think I might have done this. Actually, I'm pretty sure I didn't do this, so this has me curious. It's down there, lava and redstone.
Oh. And my lava is gone. And we have a scully after me. Skelly seems to have disappeared. And he's back. Hey! Hey! Come on, fall into the lava. Dang it! Stupid Skelly! Oh man. I need to eat. Gah. Not off to a good start today. There we go. Thank you. And he dropped his arrow. Although I do not have a bow yet because I cannot craft it. Ah, oh, I'm in the bad spot, aren't I? Okay, so... What do we have up on this wall? I would like to know, but I can't see. And... Dirt. Holy cow, that, that's a fun box. Okay, so we have a fun box right there. A fun box is a box with nine spawners in it. And... I guess you just charge the wall. And I'm spawning ghasts and all sorts of mobs. And I run into Obsidian. Now Obsidian is first going to take one minute to break through. And it looks like it goes all the way down. Fix is smart in that regard. So, hmm. I don't know how to handle this wall. I can't even see it fully or properly in this darkness. Oh, there's one of the ghasts. <laughs> okay. Hmm. I could get this diamond beneath me. Because I do know it's beneath me. Um, but I'd much rather try finding the monuments. The iron armor is holding up pretty well. Yep, that is a creeper after me. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, so this is the hole I fell down. So I am going in circles. Gosh dang it. Skelly's are still as annoying. <laughs> still annoying as always. And he's still after me. Well, 
You gotta love skellies, right? No, you don't. Yet you, you, uh, you should hate them, cause they are evil. Oh man. I don't know what to do. Maybe go back up. <laughs> Lovely. Fighting tactics have definitely definitely need to be different than normal because of the uh, way health works, and I have to remember that as I go through this map. The sun is going down, and we have a huge hole here, which is what I'm interested in right now. Maybe go up to it. There is some glowstone there. Um, I'm thinking pillar up, because I don't have the picks to really, yeah, I don't have enough picks to uh, dig my way up through this stone, and I want to save my iron pick if possible, and so we're going to go up here. Just because we have our backs, uh, our back to something at, at the very least. Okay, we are up at the top, so we could go. Is this the monument? I don't know. It excites me though. I hope it's the monument. Oh, dang it, don't waste blocks, please. Let's slide it up. Gravel. It scared me. I thought I was opening at first because my gravel is dark. And... Hmm. It does look promising, doesn't it? There's some cobblestone over there. And mossy cobblestone. And this is all sand. So I should not update the roof. It looks like I made it perfectly to here. It is a monument. Oh my goodness, I finally found it. You know how, what, how happy this makes me. What is this? A cave system? That's a trap if I ever saw one. Or not. And now I'm placing iron because my mouse. Oh man, my mouse. Please stop. I have a lot of coal, but no sticks yet. I really need to get a tree farm going. And it doesn't look like there's a chest in here. Poke a hole in the ground and some lava so the lava flows into the hole we could go check out this whoa Ooh, an iron patch yellow wool haha <laughs> sweet you go put yellow wool on the monuments let's take away these little mess ups monuments you get yellow wool placed on you so you need the three block, the three metal blocks, and yellows near the beginning. Yes, right there. No, 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 no. One nineteenth done. And now, 
I kind of do want to update this. And prepare for the lag spike. It is night time, so let's go um, get a safe spawn. And I did not climb up first. Well, not a safe spawn, just night time. Cool. There are lots of mobs up there. Whoa. <laughs> so the cakes marks the traps. And nope, that's a bad spot. I actually will... Quick mine through the sand. Dang, this makes me really, really nervous. And yep, I'm taking, taking heavy fire. <laughs> Three skeletons. Look at all those arrows. Goodness. Okay, so what I need is some wood right now. I can't see a thing, and it's just driving me nuts. <laughs> Let's actually make the sandstone. And there's no shift clicking. Hooray! Okay, if I do fall, it is all water, except along this edge. So that's. Okay. Actually, let me go grab my lava back. Let's go around. Go grab this lava. What is this? It seems like a gravel vein. Actually, no, I do not have any iron ingots yet. This looks like to be a way down, correct, and what is this? It's light. Cool. I like this fast mining uh, technique. Oh. This seems like a safer place to go up at. But 
Ooh. Oh, hey. This is right by spawn. That's cool. Um, I do remember there being trees up here on the surface, and I think those would be a good mission to go for, since I got yellow wool, and I found the monument, finally. I think it's directly beneath here. But we're in all these chests again. More diamond shovels. Food. Um, we could restock on a few of these. Infinite diamond shovels. Some signs. Maybe I should grab one of those because I needed it before. But now I am looking for... Signs of there's a chest over there. Um, yeah, I think I might because I remember the stuff being that direction from trial number two. Oh, did he burn? Sweet. Whoop. A little bit of lag, but let's go. You have to watch out for fun boxes, because I remember them being all over the surface. And fall damage. Um, this looks like a trap. But it's not. Ooh, torches, food. Another iron sword. That compass could always point me to the monument and spawn, so I'm keeping it. But we do not need more yellow wool, so I'll throw that away for in, in that chest. Um, And I just ate that apple, didn't I? Oh goodness. Where is that Scully? Where is that Scully? There he is. Yeah. Okay. This was one way to win. Did take just a little bit of damage. Not enough to go eating. And let's try to get that tree. Okay, there's a tree over there, but that's. I remember it being more to the, my right. Here we go. Nope. Oh, and that's a fun box. Holy cow. No. Wow, that was too close to comfort. Ah, fun boxes. Great. Just great. Man, they really wreck your armor and health super fast. Look at my armor. Iron armor does not wear, wear, wear down that fast. But does in 1.7. So I need, I really need to get 
I'll go for this tree then. Let's try to go up here towards this light. See, I can't even see that zombie at all. Like, goodness, I'm glad for that brightness bar, and I need to probably play with it down more. There doesn't seem to be anything up here. Hmm. Just a tree. Oh man, I do see a lot of walking mobs down there. And yes, that is out of the boundaries of the map. Here's a chest over there. Let's see a lava. There's that one tree. Um, this is tough, guys. This is very tough. I'm not used to 1.7 stuff. I don't think it's even worth it to try bridging. I think it would be too slow. It's just too, too dark, isn't it? Black desert, indeed. Okay, so... Food situation is okay. Let's try to get to this my bed since I stupidly left it behind. I'm really squinting right now. Okay. It's right Ooh. ow, dang it. And it wears down armor too. I just thought I was hearing lots of footsteps right there. Uh, we got nothing accomplished except wearing down armor and food. So, we're doing well, right? Sure. And here we go. For good measure, <laughs> uh, so let's let's get that tree. We must get that tree. We have dirt right here, so you don't have to worry about the dirt. All right. And this is darkness and mobs and good fun stuff. Burning zombie. It's a fun box up there, so don't want to go up there. This sneaks below, but there's a ton of mobs and. I think I think the key to victory here would be just avoid mob fights. I mean, we could take them out just like that, but with my situation. Oh yes, maybe a oh I should really get a diamond sword because those mobs don't have the same type of health they do, and. 1.2.5 and instead they will always be two hit by diamond swords so maybe we don't
don't have to automatically avoid this is kind of creepy that's a improperly designed sapling yes forget it I'm not going for that tree although maybe I could because I know a wool is there I also remember a fun box and I'm just running back I need to uh, farm some trees and stuff yes I see you zombies Let's fight this one though oh dang it Fall damage, fall damage. They're taking fall damage too. It's a creeper. Yeah, my current state, I just want to get out of here. And that involves planting this upling. Um, where to do it? There doesn't seem to be a whole lot of room. We need the dirt. There we go. We have a few bits of dirt. But I have an idea of where to put it. Wait, how tall is this room? Not tall enough. Instead, there is a huge opening here that we could put it in. Even go down it. Down. So let's clear out all the sand. I'm sneaking because that's the way to avoid monsters, apparently. Yes, sneaking. Makes you invisible to monsters. Yeah. Yeah. We have plenty of room right here to grow a tree. And we're going to do that. We have the bones too. Dang it. Shift clicking. <laughs> Okay, and grow! It is a desert biome indeed. Um, Before we go chopping it down, I do want to protect the saplings.
complete. Okay, cool. So my bed is able to be slept in on this in this area, and I have trees going. Um, I was almost unlucky with the sapling on the last tree, so I'm hoping to grow a huge tree in this area. Don't want to waste bones though, and I'll soon need a steady source of food, uh, mushrooms. Might be good because there's a ton of them on the surface. However, I've gone long enough today in this episode. I've gotten the base and I've finally found the victory monuments. So I am happy. And I will see you next episode.